Welcome to our trusted enrollment demo video. Imagine using government services from your smartphone comfortably, securely, anytime. A user simply needs a camera found on a phone or tablet. The user is prompted to take a selfie. Just look straight at the camera, have enough light, and you're done. As simple as it seems, a lot goes on in the background. AI-powered algorithms extract the data from the ID using OCR. This ensures the authenticity of the ID and the reliability of the validity check. Active Liveness Check is another option to verify identity. It can prompt a user to perform a simple task, such as following a moving dot on the screen. The algorithm monitors the movement of the pupils, evaluating whether the dot has been followed correctly. After taking a photo of the ID and a selfie, the user can double-check the extracted data and either correct or confirm them. A picture of another document can also be added, such as a driver's license, for a more comprehensive verification. Now let's see what this new enrollment looks like from the operator's viewpoint. All the data extracted from the ID and from the selfie are evaluated as trust factors. They're shown as a score on a scale from 1 to 100. The higher the number, the more accurate the data is, and vice versa. The trust factors are liveness check, document face verification, selfie verification, and uniqueness. We can now see they're all green. If we try to spoof the process, they turn red due to the very low scores. Below are all the extracted data from the ID document. The automated ID classifier identifies the document type, edition, and issuing country from the captured picture. Predefined fields of the onboarding form are automatically filled with the extracted personal data. It all seems incredibly straightforward, but let's observe what transpires when a fraudster tries to spoof the process. In this case, identity was not verified due to the very low liveness score. The operator is immediately notified about a fraudulent attempt. For example, if someone with a stolen ID tries to apply for a visa or a document, almost instantly, trained algorithms are able to verify the liveness of the person. These algorithms are safeguards against presentation attacks, like using a printed picture or a mask intended to fool the system. When the system yields a very low uniqueness score, it is a warning to the operator that another user already exists with the same ID or face stored in the database. Our trusted enrollment module is capable of comparing an ID or selfie against the entire database within a few seconds, after which it can either ascertain it's a duplicate or prove that the identity is indeed unique. This is how liveness is calculated in the background. Say a person on a block list or band register tries to enroll to get hold of a driver's license or visa using a fake ID. Even though the face might get a match, it will give a score of almost zero for uniqueness. Biometric authentication compares faces and IDs against the entire register and can easily recognize fraud. Since the entire history of actions is saved in the register, operators can therefore easily check all the data, investigate the duplicate, and decide whether the attempt was a fraud or not.